Hello, YouTubes. We are about to perpetrate up an at home one last time. I want to take a final walkthrough and see if there's anything new this week. They usually put stuff out every week, uh, all the way through up until Halloween. I'm going to go in there and see if anything's changed. Um, I'm going to look for new stuff. Anything that's uh, that I think's cool, we're going to show. And then uh, probably before Halloween ends, I'll take another walk through there. And if I see anything new, I'll just capture it individually on video. And I'll share that towards the end of the season. Because I don't know how much more they're going to put out. So let's go inside and see what they got new for us today. Oh, man, they got a huge, big display set up now. Look at all this stuff. It looks like they brought everything out from the shelves over to here. Ooh, litter gingerbread house. Does nothing. The glitter probably ruined it. Let's see, they got the big pumpkins. They got these ghosts. $99 for the ghosts. And they feel like there's some kind of uh, breakable resin of some kind. They're pretty thin. Looks like it might light up or something. Pumpkin bats. This is like glitter heaven over here. Let's get the hell away from here. Let's see what else they got. Happy Halloween little tree and sign. She's pretty creepy. She's $12.99. That's pretty creepy. Uh, let's see, they got a little skull covered in freaking glitter. God, what is the glitter, folks? Spider stack pumpkins. Little individual bag of pumpkins for $5.99. Got the boo signs, not a fan, that's too cutesy. They got another little creepy witch. What else they got? like Christmas ornaments there is just a whole big table of stuff there is no uh, inflatable table they don't have their other display out that they usually do with all the skeletons at the far end of the store oh look at this it's like a little uh, tree little dress form or something with a little witch on it that's $20 for that huh, pretty crazy looks like it's all just kind of small little stuff on this table now this is actually pretty cool you get four cups you get a spider a cat a pumpkin skull and that's all for 11.99 that's actually pretty cool oh no it's got a crack in it already nope well, don't want that one all right let's run over the shelf and see if we can find anything else new okay so i'm back at this aisle and oh my god they've got them back thank god because these were gone they had maybe 10 the first time and they were gone this is so cool it's sold the only other thing i see new is a little raven he's kind of chintzy but he's only 6.99 so it's not bad and they have these flocked thankful man that's gotta be freaking it's thanksgiving what is that doing over here these are new what's this little guy just a little tombstone for 3.99 all right what the hell is this oh it's like a pumpkin with a skull coming out of it it's kind of uh squishy a little bit how much is this guy? He's $29.99? Oh no, uh-uh. All it is is like a pumpkin with the skull sticking out of it. I can make that. All right, let's see what else they got new. This is all based on the same stuff we saw. I don't see the rose and the cloche anymore. Oh, these are new. We didn't see these last time. Spider webs with little candelabras. So that's kind of cool. Um, big. They got a whole sign back there that says ghouls. How much is this thing? How much is ghouls? Ghouls is free. It must be wrapped up somewhere else in another aisle. So they have welcome and ghouls. So maybe it's a two pack. A little glitter wreath up there. I'm glad that's up high where it's out of my reach. And I think we've seen all this stuff before. Keep creeping around and see what else we can find. Okay, we're by the dragons again in the little mushroom wooden head. They've got these eyeballs that are some kind of resin and heavy, $3.99. That was new, I saw. They got one of those little gargoyles down there. The killer plants, they got a couple more of those. Uh, what else did I see? They had a wine set, $9.99. So you just stick that in your little uh, bottle of booze or some Jack Daniels. That's a topper, but it actually feels pretty lightweight and kind of chintzy. They got the little booze uh, jugs for $10. I think Scott, was that Scott who asked me about the price of these candles just to make sure? $14.99. I thought they were $12.99. They were black candles. Looks like that's about all they have new in this aisle. 
Uh, I don't see much else. All right, let's go in the other aisles and see what else they got. Maybe there's something new over there. Okay, so we're back by the hangars. The only one I see new is this one. She's kind of creepy. Kind of looks like uh, Cruella DeVille a little bit with button eyes. I'd definitely be changing out those eyes. And she is... She's $17.99. So that's not bad. And she's small. She's lightweight. Uh, you could probably do something better with her. I think we saw all these. We got a couple of big giant spiders, which I haven't seen before. And they're falling all over the damn store. Okay, spiders are already pissing me off. Okay, they're goofy looking. No thanks. Looks like they got a bat the same way. All right, get in there. I'm sorry, people. I'm rearranging your store. My bad. Okay, I have not seen these. What are these? These are new, but they got little goofy eyes. And these guys are $4.99. Oh, and he fell down. The only other thing new I see in this aisle is this little witch. She looks like some kind of little druid or something. She's really pretty. She's uh, $34.99. And she's got some kind of little, uh, like, lizard skin kind of little dress. Got some curls in her hair. Pretty cool for a little druid-type doll. So if you're having, like, a druid-type, uh, that's the floor. If you're a Wiccan, hey, this one's for you. She's got a little dragon staff, too. So that's pretty cool. Looks like they got a little dragon egg for $12.99. What's it do? Oh, it just lights up. One spider, get out of there. Yeah, this little pumpkin. Oh, a little pumpkin with webs next to it. What are these little guys? $5.99? Yeah, so not too much in this aisle. Same old stuff it looks like. I'll go creep back in the other aisle and see if I get anything else. Yeah, right before I went to the next aisle, I saw this big thing of creepy cloth for $8. But this thing is 36 feet long. How crazy is that? That's a lot of creepy cloth for 8 bucks. So that might actually be worth it to go ahead and spend it on a, on a big batch of creepy cloth for eight bucks. That's a lot of creepy cloth, but the other ones are nine foot, 10 inches by two and a half. And those are $1.99. So dollar store definitely got that beat, but as far as these big packages go, it might be worth investing here at home to get uh, a monster sheet of creepy cloth, especially if you're doing a super long prop. So let's go around the corner to another aisle and see what else they have. All right, so I'm around the corner, found a couple other cool things. I think they had these from last year, these little light up pumpkins. They're just a white light inside. This is kind of cool. Everlasting life potion covered in glitter spiders. No, thank you. They do have a little creepy looking wizard. He's got a little skull in his beard. He's pretty sharp looking. He's $29.99, uh, so he's $30. So that's not too bad. I saw these little lizards. These are some kind of resin lizards. These guys are $9.99. If you like uh, the little witch theme, but they're so cheap. I saw this guy and his legs and feet are already busted off. So for nine bucks, I'd say a new. And these I thought were pretty cool. These are new. I didn't see these last time. These cauldrons are 29 bucks. Looks like they pop right out of their uh, little stand. They come with a metal stand. Yeah, they're all metal. So it'd be a nice candy bowl or something, or maybe put some fog in there, or some stuff for the kids, you know? Thought that'd be cool, but the uh, that's 29 bucks so kind of cool i might get like one of those on clearance or maybe at the end of halloween what is this a smash candle nobody wants a smash candle all right i'm gonna take another look around see if we can find anything else new oh rugs we got a couple of these happy halloween with a pair of cat's eyes ten dollars what other styles i got these rugs are horrible they won't last but a couple of months the sun will bleach them out really fast so the pumpkins are, uh, that's a no-go for me on those. You got the pumpkins. What is this one? A couple years ago, they had the really cool moth one. I got that one. Let's see what this one is. No, that's pretty sharp. And that's nine bucks. That'd be great for a front porch or in front of your sink or something like that. This one's kind of a goofy, cutesy one. We'll pass on that one. Looks like that's the only style is the skulls. And the cats. Or they got candy corn, which is, eh, not too cool. All right, I'll fold this guy up, put him back on the shelf. And we'll go to that next aisle and see if there's anything left of new stuff in Halloween. All right, folks, that's it. We're here at the at home. I kind of went through and found everything I could. Found all the new stuff that I thought was pretty cool that kind of stood out. Um, I'll probably come back a little bit for Halloween. I think this will be our last uh, kind of walkthrough at this store. Um, 
like I said, if I see anything new when I come back from my separate trips, I'll just add it to a bigger video at the end, and we'll go back and review everything we've seen. So I will see you guys in a week or so. We're going to be at uh, Party City. We're going to be at Big Lots. We're going to be at uh, Menards. We're going to hit up all the Halloween hotspots. So just stay tuned. And if you guys like this, give me a thumbs up. I'm going to do these videos so you guys don't leave the house. If you can see the stuff you like and the price you want it, uh, I'm more than happy to go out and hunt for you guys. And you can go out and buy the stuff you want and spend as little time as out of the house and being home and staying safe as you can. So I will see you guys in a week. Thanks so much for watching.